Somebody asked me to show them the process of how I glue the back of my rug, so I'm going to show you. Before you start gluing, you always want to pull out these loose strands. You're always going to have these if you tough them because it's just how the gun operates and it's going to pull those strands through and you're going to have them in your rug. You can glue over them, but I choose not to because I want to have an overall better product in the end. Yes, it's time consuming, but it's worth it if you want a good product. The adhesive that I use is Henry 170. You could get this from almost anywhere, but I get it from Lowe's. So when I start gluing my rug, I make sure to do it as even as possible. You're not always gonna have it perfect, but you don't want too much glue in one spot to where it's gonna take a long time to dry or one area is clumpy and the other one is not. So that's just part of it. You, you gotta figure out your happy medium. If you're tucked in inside of your house, I would advise you to put something on the floor, not fabric. I'll use cardboard or I'll use a tarp or some type of plastic because most of the time you're gonna drop some glue and you don't want those problems. Now, earlier I was talking about the strands that come through the other side of the rug. Once I start gluing, I don't pull out any more strands. I just push them into the rug. You already have glue on it, so it's not gonna be that major of a problem if you miss those. So go back in, push them into the back of your rug, and they'll just glue down. They, they won't be a problem at all. Gluing your rug, really, it ain't that hard. You just wanna kinda make sure you pay attention to your edges. That's gonna be an important part of your rug later. So make sure you focus on those edges. Get those glued very good. And then just go back in your lines, smooth everything out, and make sure that you're getting glue even over everything. Now, once your glue dry, you may see some places where you need to put more glue, and that's fine. You could just go back in later and add that glue because it'll potentially save you some time. You don't want to glue too heavy like I used to because it used to take probably 48 hours and some change for one rug to dry and that's because i was putting too much glue so go in get a decent amount of glue on your rug fill in all the lines if you have to refill later go back and do that but if you glue too heavy you're going to waste a lot of time and you don't want people waiting on your product so as much as you can get everything in there and that's all it is to it it, it ain't really no hard science whenever i let my rugs dry most of the time I put a fan on them. If not, then you could just let them go and they'll dry. But this should take probably 24 hours to dry. And that's it. So that's my gluing process. Peace.